arrested nearly a dozen people featured on Fugitive Search since last month. News 18's Holly Campbell explains what role the community plays in helping police find people wanted in Tippecanoe County. Fugitive featured on News 18's Fugitive Search is in custody. Lafayette it's been Police a common Brandon. theme since the beginning of April. Nine people featured on News 18's Fugitive Search were arrested days after their information aired. It's been a good streak as far as how quickly they've been, been located. Um, I would say it's a little abnormal for them to be that quick, usually at least a couple days, but uh, there's been a few of them that have been located the same day. Lafayette Police detectives send News 18 information every Thursday for a person wanted on a warrant. We also uh, send out NICSO alerts um, to the community to make them aware of that and uh, post it on our Lafayette Police Department website. And it seems to be working. Sometimes the person is arrested before their information even airs, as was the case Thursday with Jamal Stewart. Detective Jared Sounders says 21-year-old Elena Ward was the subject of this week's fugitive search and was arrested in Carroll County Friday. Sounders says a lot of the credit for these arrests goes to the community. I think it's a little bit of a lucky streak and it's also the help of the community. Um, once that is aired, a lot of times we get a lot of reliable tips that come in which lead us into the direction of that fugitive. Tips Sounders says are crucial when looking for someone who may be a danger to the community. Holly Campbell, News 18.